Hello my friends and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are all doing well. Um, if you're new here, my name is Ella. If you're new here, you've come at a great time. This is probably like the peak climax of content on my channel. <laughs> probably one of the most exciting videos that I have and will ever upload on YouTube. This is truly the start of a new and very exciting chapter. Um, as you can probably tell from the title, I am moving out. Or I have moved out. I'm here. Here's a little sneak peek for you. Don't mind the mess in the background. I'm still in the process of unpacking. Finally, I have done it. I have moved out and it feels so bloody good. I'm so happy. I really am. Um, I'm gonna have to position myself sorry <laughs> i'm on my knee and it's going numb and it's just it's not sustainable nick and i have been talking about moving oh my god that sun <laughs> Hello. As many of you know, Nick and I have been talking about moving out for a long time now. It's probably been like a year, year and a half. It's been a goal of ours for a while now. Um, but actually finding this place and the whole application process and actually moving out has all happened very, very fast. It's been a complete and utter whirlwind, but it's been amazing. Um, so to catch you guys up to speed, which I'll probably do a whole separate Q&A video really soon, because um, I'm sure you guys have a lot of questions. But long story short, I have been keeping an eye on like realestate.com and domain and all those real estate apps and websites for a while now just to see what's out there um if anything did come up having a look at it and really just trying to get an idea of what we can get within our budget the other day literally the other day it was probably like two weeks ago now like i said it's happened fast i was just doing my normal searches and i came across this place you know when you just see something and you just get that gut feeling it was one of those moments and i was like you know what I think this is it. I sent it to Nick. He really liked it. Um, obviously, we wanted to see it in person. So I took it upon myself. There was no open inspection scheduled. So I took it upon myself to email the real estate agent directly and ask if we could have a viewing. Turned out she was actually there that day showing some other people around. Um, so literally an hour later, I was in the car with my mom on the way. We toured it. I loved it. It's literally so perfect. It's a cute little two bedroom apartment, perfect for the both of us. It's recently been redone, so it's nice and modern and updated, which is really my vibe. And the location. The location was probably the biggest seller for the both of us. Not seller, because we didn't buy it, but <laughs> a girl can dream. Um, but like the biggest tick for the both of us. Nick and I have been very spoiled in terms of where our family homes are positioned. We're both very close to the beach and in like beach suburbs. Um, and we really didn't want to give that up, like give that lifestyle up I guess but finding something within our price range in this same kind of general area um, is very very difficult until we stumbled across this place which was well within our budget um, and literally right on the beach I can see the sea from this very window as I'm vlogging right now I can hear the waves it is just it's unreal. I'm so happy. <laughs> Obviously, I've been vlogging this whole entire process for you guys. I mean, I've vlogged every other moment in my life. Why wouldn't I? So I have so many moving vlogs and so much content to come. I cannot wait to show you guys at this place and us moving and unpacking and just the whole process. Um, it's been a real journey and we <laughs> are not done yet. But the footage that you're about to see, I actually never introed. I just kind of launched straight into it, so this is the intro. But the footage you're about to see is from the same day that we signed the lease. That night after Nick finished work, we went to Kmart. Um, and then we also went to Ikea that same weekend. You guys will see. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this footage from us doing our first little home shopping. Stay tuned for all the other moving vlogs to come. I love you guys. Thank you so much for all the love and support. I posted a photo over on my Instagram, and I've been updating you guys a lot on my Instagram story. Um, and just so many lovely messages and comments, and it honestly means the world. So yeah, enjoy the vlog. We are doing our first exciting shop of the moving out process. We've come to Kmart Friday night. Woo! <laughs> Raging Friday night. Excited, babe? Yeah, Tom said it's more of a Sunday afternoon activity. <laughs> also, look where Nick just parked. Right in front of you. Do you not think that is the rudest thing ever? It's the print, is it? Oh, you're choosing that one, are you? Yep. I would have gone that one personally. <laughs> Wow, you testing in the mask. <laughs> little pro tip for anyone that's moving out. Make a little wish list on Kmart so you can stay focused. Have we got anything? We have not got one thing in our basket that's not on the list. Did we get a rice cream? Was it rice Yeah, it was on there. You go. Well. I wasn't listening. <laughs> <laughs> We've moved on to the bathroom section. A little bin. There's Nick and his element, loving his life. Hello, my friends. So it is Sunday morning now. What time is it? Almost 10 o'clock. We had a nice cook breakfast with my family, grabbed a coffee. Thanks, Miss Fobo for eight. Coming through with the goods. We have a lot 
a lot of places you want to hit up today. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna go to Ikea, then we're gonna go to this like furniture warehouse place and check out some stuff there. Kmart, because they didn't have the toaster that we wanted that matches the kettle that we got in stock. I think it's probably one of the biggest things around this time that I've noticed is that like nothing is in stock because of Corona. There's a Kmart near the Ikea so we're gonna hit up that one because I think it's in stock, fingers crossed. Then we're gonna go look for a TV, also wanna get a coffee machine and mattress. Wow, a big day ahead but yeah we're gonna hit up Ikea first. I have a list on my phone. Probably my biggest tip for anyone that's moving out is to write lists. You just don't buy unnecessary things that you don't need. Like that really helped us when we went to Kmart. We knew exactly what we needed and we got in there and got out in a very reasonable amount of time. Was good. Hmm. Man, a few words. Thanks for that. <laughs> Aisle five, location thirty-one. Gorgeous. I might take a photo of it as well. Oh, uh, did they have it? They don't have it. They have the white one. We'll go have a look. Okay, this is the coffee table we're going with. Happy with that? Yeah, very. This is where the magic happens. This is the coffee table that we want, but they're out of stock in the white one, which is a bit sad. But we got the unit. That All is of this coffee. stuff. That is a good cocktail, I like. Yeah, we'll wait. Patience is a virtue. All done at Ikea. We are just leaving now. We're gonna go check out. This is gonna be fun. <laughs> we have so much stuff. Did you wait until you were in a quiet hour by yourself? Yes, it's so busy here. I cannot vlog. I can't even like move without bumping into people. So much for socially distancing. People aren't being very polite. No. So we got the goods from Ikea back there. Locked and loaded, only cost, what was it, $400? 405 I think. 405 which actually isn't that bad. We got everything for the kitchen, the laundry, bathroom, and we got a TV unit. So all in all, not bad. Anyway, we've come to Westlake's, which is not our local shopping center, but it's in the area. <laughs> and apparently the toaster that we want is in stock. So we're gonna go see, fingers crossed, really want this freaking toaster. If not, we're gonna have to reassess. How are you feeling, babe? Good, very good. Tired? No, no, I'm refreshed. When we went to Kmart, he was so tired. Yeah, was, did you explain why? Because he just had five days of work. No. <laughs> Computer broke and I lost a 4,000 word essay, which I'd done 3,000 words of and had to start 3,000, 2,000. Let's not dramatize right, the story right, for the vlog. Classic YouTuber. It was two, it was two five. <laughs> Basically, he was working every single day, Monday to Friday, and then coming home and doing a 4,000 word essay. So he was super tired when we went to Kmart. Um, but he is in better spirits because it's submitted, baby. Absolute disaster. Okay, a little update time. I'm sorry if the quality keeps changing, by the way. I'm switching between this camera and my G7X. So we ended up going to Kmart and not having the toaster. Not, I can't speak. <laughs> they didn't have the toaster in stock. Do you mind? It was like the loudest. <laughs> no, you can put them on, babe. I was kidding. <laughs> Yeah, so I left. I need you. Yeah, the toaster ended up not being in stock in Kmart, which is such a bummer because it said it was. But it actually ended up <laughs> working out for the best. We ended up going into Target. We went over and looked in the appliance section and they had almost identical. If anything, it was better. And it looks almost identical to the toaster that we were after. And it matches the kettle or it should match the kettle almost perfectly. So a win-win. And it was basically the same price. And it was last month. So... All in all, very successful. And then we just went to the Australian Furniture Warehouse. Is that what it's called? Yeah, great place. Yeah. They were so lovely. It's like a wholesale furniture store. So they buy a bunch of one thing and then sell it for like half the price. So we got the loveliest couch for like, how much was it? 700? 700 down from I think 1,300. Yeah, so almost half price and it's such good quality. It's so comfortable. We might go back and get the two-seater, but we're just trying to weigh up how much, much space we have because it's quite a small apartment. We also got a bed. We chose one bed initially and then it was actually out of stock, which kind of, I don't know. I think everything happens at well, We were weighing up the two beds. and We, we were weighing up between two and then the one we ended up picking was actually already sold. So we went with the other one, but they gave it to us at a really good price because they felt bad, <laughs> which is so lovely. So yeah. 
everything happens for a reason, maybe that bed is meant to be. We'll see. Hopefully. I think it will look good with the white sheets. Maybe better than the grey. I don't know. We'll see. Now um, we are headed to one of our last stops for the day. We're going to head to The Good Guys. Oh, and Fantastic Furniture. Sorry, I lied. Last two spots of the day. And maybe Jamie Hi-Fi. And maybe Jamie. <laughs> And maybe my, <laughs> and maybe my, <laughs> just our last four stops I'm of the day. Dropping it home. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Really. It's like 2:40 at the moment, so we've had a very good day. We've bought a lot, but we have saved a lot. The bed sheets were originally $170, and we got them for 70, so $100 off, and they were really nice. Linen house, lovely stuff. The towels were also linen house. They're like Egyptian towels, which I normally wouldn't even care about, but they felt so lovely. And they were like $30 off each, or 20, $20 off each. Okay, update time. We are now home. I feel like I've been the world's worst vlogger, but we have just been doing our thing. It has been such a long day but i feel so accomplished we really got some good deals i love a good deal especially when you're moving out and it's so goddamn expensive i think probably my biggest tip i'm giving all the tips like who do i think i am gandhi probably not my biggest tip is to do your research before luckily i'm not working at the moment so i was able to dedicate like a good day or two of researching appliances and like things we want and just like planning everything out the two main places we went to as you guys saw was kmart yesterday was it yesterday or friday i don't know what day is it? Who am I? <laughs> Everything else, we also had an idea of like where we might buy it from, um, but we just wanted to see it in person. Um, but yeah, we got literally everything we need apart from a fridge and like a few other little things, but all the essentials are right here. We got a TV, we got a new mattress, we ordered our bed and our lounge. That's getting delivered on Thursday. All the stuff for the kitchen. This is the toaster that I was talking about. I also got a cushion. Very happy with my cushion. We got bed sheets, we really just got it all. We got a coffee machine as well, and the lady was so lovely. <laughs> I feel like I need to give her a shout out. If you're ever going to buy a coffee machine and you live in Adelaide, you need to go to the Harvey Norman near Marion. She was so lovely, she was really small. Like really small, I think that's probably her biggest feature, identifying feature. Don't know her name, but she gave us a bunch of like free pods, gave us the machine that was sold out like everywhere. Very happy with her service. Did she? Yeah. Oh, thank you so much. This lovely, <laughs> this lovely young couple. What if we were brother and sister? A bit of an awkward.